Hi, it's Sue from Aging Joyfully. I decided that I can use one of my IKEA pegboards right here behind me to hang jewelry and my hats. I have a black IKEA pegboard in another room that I found that I'm not using. I'm going to hang it on these two walls, one here on the side wall and one on the back wall, and I'm going to organize my jewelry and hats. Because I use the command strips instead of drilling holes in the wall, it should be very easy to move and it shouldn't damage the wall that I'm taking it off of. Here it is. Here it is unused. I'm going to pull it down and it sh I should have no problem pulling it down. So I pulled it down. I still have the command strips on the wall. They'll come off without damaging the paint. And now I'm going to take it to the bedroom. Here are the command strips that I used. They are for hanging pictures. You can find these anywhere. As you see, I still have, I still have the four command strips in each corner. So I just need to put one on top of it and let it stay there for a little bit. Place it right on top and press together and it makes a little snapping noise. We'll do it at all four. Press it right on top. Press together. This is so much easier than putting holes in the wall and then having to patch those if you decide you don't like where you're using your board. But these are so flexible and you can use them for so many things in the house. From bedroom to office to playroom to kitchen. As you see, I've added the strips on the back and I'm going to put it on the wall. I'm going to use a level. I'm going to start with the side wall here. this first board I did clean the walls with hydrogen peroxide to get all the dust and debris or dirt off of there so this will adhere better so now I've got the second board I'm going to let those stay for a few hours just so that it can adhere to the wall before I hang anything on there. That'll make it hang better. Then I'll make sure letting it sit there for a couple hours on the tape adhere to the wall will ensure that it's less likely to fall. I don't want to put heavy items on it until it's been sitting there and adhere to the wall. So I'll check back in in a couple of hours and hang my jewelry and hats and show you what it looks like. Here are the boards on the wall. I did use the level to make sure they are level. And I uh, did clean the walls with hydrogen peroxide to get rid of dust and any dirt on the walls so that it will adhere better. I'm letting this sit for a couple hours before I hang anything. And then it's going to look so great. I love the black because it goes with our blackout curtains in here. We moved down to this room about eight months ago and we've absolutely loved it. We sleep much better where there's no TV in the room. No computer, no distractions, so you focus on sleeping, which makes you healthier. So while these boards are adhering to the wall for a couple hours, I'm going to show you the accessories I bought. I do have some black accessories that were in the other room, but when I ordered them last time, they were out of many, so I didn't have a lot. But this time, I ordered some to be shipped to my house, and shipping was free if you spent over $50. I had never heard of that before. I don't know if that's a one-time thing or if they do that all the time now. It's so much easier than having to go there. And everything was in stock this time. So here's the fun things that I bought. I bought three of these. These will be either for necklaces or for, um, or for my hats. I wear a hat every time I go outside because I had 
skin cancer in my scalp area so I'm always trying to prevent that so I'm always wearing a hat and it also helps if it, the hat shades your eye area to prevent the, the sl to help the slow the slowing of getting cataracts so if you keep the protect your eyes with the hat as well as your head and face it's a good idea to do that to prevent uh, cataracts and also skin cancer so I got three of these I don't know I don't know what I paid for these they weren't too expensive at all I got two of these bags of hooks five come in and these also can be for um, my hats this isn't for the board, but I'm going to hang this in our shower where I hang a shower cap. The hook I had fell down, so this is a pack of three. They were pretty cheap. I got some black clips. I use a lot of these white clips. You can put pictures or anything you want on there. I got some more of these three containers with black lids. I have several of these already, but I'm going to put earrings in these. And I guess the more I have, I could separate them so the earrings don't get all tangled up together and then I got a black shelf for who knows what <laughs> the rest of the items we bought are she loves their bags like their Ziploc type bags their Ikea bags they're very durable he loves them so he bought a ton of them I'm just going to show you those Steve bought three of these it's two different bags in each box and three of these and honestly I don't see the difference in size they all say 1.2 liters and one quart I'm going to pull it out and show you the different sizes in the bags. In this box you got one of these pink size bags and one of these red bags. And they are actually the same size as these. This box you got a yellow bag and a black bag. But they are actually the same size but they were very affordable. They were on sale and at Boosted I ordered to $50 so we got the free shipping. Here's my jewelry today all tangled up in a bowl. We're going to get it nice and neat and organized.